So I thought it was a really good opportunity to, to hop in and start a vlog so that you can follow me on my journey. Uh, I know I already know how to play guitar and I already know how to do a lot of things uh, musically, but drums is something that is definitely fresh for me. And since I spend so much time working with the drummers uh, in you know, playing in bands, I thought it would be cool to actually learn what's going on in their head. Um, and that's really where this started. But one of the things that kind of came up in this while I was doing it is I realized uh, in society today, there's a lot of bullying. There's a lot of uh, people out there that feel like they're not good enough or that are scared to try new things because they don't want to get made fun of. And coming up in this holiday season, you know, um, you know, right now it's, it's right now it's October. Crap. Um, we're in the beginning of October when this is being recorded and we're coming up on the next month or two of the holidays and you know I know there's probably a lot of you out there that are looking for drums looking for guitars looking for a new instrument maybe you want to pick up piano or ukulele so I know for you guys you know watching a drum vlog isn't necessarily going to give you any information but I hope that inspires you and helps you to go out there and take that leap of faith and try something new and um, and stick with it, you know, because it doesn't matter. Guitar, drums, you know, right now I do a week of drums and stuff. It's hard. I've been practicing at least 20 minutes every day, cranking away, focused, trying to, you know, get some sort of comfortability. Oh, hey there, YouTube. How you doing? What's this? TJ from Guitar Crate? Also awesome drummer? Not quite. So, um, I want to do something a little different. Hopefully as some inspiration. But uh, as a 20-year as a guitar player in the business, pretty much the whole time, you know, I've, I've gotten to learn and know a lot about playing guitar. One thing that I tried once very briefly uh, about 15 years ago was to try the drums and quite frankly it was a train wreck so I wanted to put this video out to show you guys you know kind of the journey of what it is to be a musician I can't really backtrack for guitar but as far as drums go uh, I am so gracious or I'm so lucky to have a drummer that uh, doesn't mind showing me the ropes so we've actually been swapping lessons and I get to fulfill my lifelong dream of hitting stuff without having a white boy rhythm. So, um, I had my first lesson last week. I've been practicing all week. I want to be at least a little bit good before I showed off what I can do. Um, but essentially, I've been given my own transcription book. And in here it has some of the simple notes in here and it's got me going in quarter notes with a kick and a snare um, and then it just tells me the different ways to practice he gave me all the different rhythms um, so so there's that but here's the catch I if you have not been following the guitar channel I am a left-handed player. I am left-handed golf. I am left-handed baseball. I am left-handed writing. I am left-handed guitar playing. I am left-handed everything. But anywhere I go with other people to play drums, I've got a right-handed kit. So I am going to try and learn to play backwards, but also not limit myself and do the left-handed techniques I need to with a right-handed kit and then play right-handed like a good boy um, so so yeah so this is gonna hopefully be the beginning of a a nice long journey of watching me progress into a reasonable if not good drum drummer and uh, hopefully it is something that for whether it's for the fails or the successes is an awesome fun thing to go through with me on this journey um, I will show you everything that I'm learning I will not edit any of the screw-ups um, for me my number one goal out of this is 
for someone who's interested in trying something new, whether it's playing guitar, whether it's playing drums or any other instrument or any other thing in life, maybe you want to be an artist. Um, I want to show you that it can be done and you know, it's never too late. Uh, so yes. Um, so and just so you guys know, um, you know, because we've got Guitar Crate, I spoke to my D'Addario dealer and told him what I was doing. Um, also my son, this is actually my son's kit, he's already a pretty good drummer. Um, but when I told the guys from D'Addario what I was doing, they sent me over some Promark drumsticks from their, from their Promark Evans line. Um, these are the classic 5A, they're like a firewood. Looks like they've been torched with a blowtorch. They're pretty awesome. Um, I haven't been playing very long, but I do like these. All right, I haven't been playing very long and I do like these, but uh, these guys right here are the 747s and I'm not sure what BW means, they're hickory. Um, but these guys right here, uh, being the fact that I'm I'm a big guy, these actually feel nice and meaty. I don't feel like I'm squeezing a toothpick. I feel like I'm grabbing a nice, nice good, um, you know, good grip and everything like that. So, um, thank you, Dario Pro Mark, and uh, so yeah. So without further ado, my first beat right here on my notepad says that I'm gonna always hit the hi hat. And then I'm gonna go kick there, but I'm always gonna hit the hi hat. So, uh, and I, you know, to be candid, I've been practicing for the last hour before I turn this camera on because, you know, I don't mind having some funny moments, but I don't want it to be ridiculous. All right. So that was the first rhythm. I made it pretty long before I knocked a stick out of my hand. This is for me the worst. So one of the things that I will also do is practice like this because I'm left handed and I'm used to this being my tempo hand. So I'll go. I just missed it. But for me that's way more comfortable so I've been forcing myself to play like this. Of course, the thing I always do is knock this stick out of my hand. Um, but hey, that's what learning's for, right? All right, so that was the first thing they gave me here. There's a couple others in here. Um, some of my favorites are like. Just because it gives me that feel like I'm like, bop, bop, bop. Yeah, I'm getting into to something cool. Uh, of course, I got nowhere to go because I don't know anything else, but. Um, and then the number one biggest thing, and this is why I've been practicing, and I'm actually kind of happy to show off because I'm not going to completely suck, but the basic rock beat. I even got that second kick in there, which was actually the reason why I stopped playing the first time I tried to play drums was because I couldn't get that second kick. So I can't do it without the hi-hat, but I've got that second kick in there and I'm really excited about that. It tells me I got hope. Um, in a week of practice, like dedicated 15, 20 minutes a day, making a trip down here, even if it means coming in late and waking up the kids. Um, it's been working. So you just witnessed my first drum session. Um, I know it was probably nothing to write home about, but I hope you enjoyed it. It's, uh, it is truly my first 
time on camera or you know in any public way showing off any drum skills i've been formally practicing for the week with you know guided with guided stuff to do and so in the spirit of you know stepping up trying something new and uh you know i hope that it inspires a bunch of you guys out there to get your own instruments and make some music and take a leap out there and not worry about whether or not someone's gonna make fun of your new song or somebody's gonna make fun of the fact that you think you might have rhythm um so you know uh you know follow me i'll be putting this up as long as people are watching i don't care you know if you want to troll me and make a bunch of comments about how much i suck go for it i'm a white boy learning rhythm so you know it's, I guarantee it's going to be entertaining. You're going to see some good stuff in here that's not going to be like positive stuff. But, you know, for all that, I hope that, you know, six months from now and a year from now, you see a drummer maybe even doing his first show. And uh, I will I will definitely be broadcasting and vlogging all of this to show you the journey and to, to take that step out there. And, uh, you know, not because I'm awesome, but because I'm going to put the work in, I'm going to stick with it. You know, I know that it's going to get to a level where I'm going to play a show and it's going to be pretty awesome. So, um, you know, subscribe, like, you know, check out our other videos at the Guitar Crate. And if you're looking for guitars this season, hey, you know, stop by guitarcrate.com. We'll get you some boxes. All right. Talk to you soon.